login button indent this indent the code okay here in css i will give header block email suit dot left password suit also dot left and the login button should also dot left okay now major padding from top twenty pixel so I'm going to give header block padding top twenty pixel you can see these are aligned and it has gone some little outside the box so I will just decrease the padding top here here is here I will give padding top 10 to logo IMG here I will give dot email label padding padding bottom 10 pixel and same thing will apply to password password label padding bottom 10 px and email input the height height of 20 pixel and width let me measure the width width is 150 pixel so give it the width of 150 pixel and this same thing will happen here in the password section password input type equals password and copy this here you can see a border little border yes there is a border in the email and password password tag so to give the border I here we have to 
at the border css property border 1 pxl solid copy copy color from here and include it here sorry copy the color same thing will go in the password section ok and there is a margin here let's get the margin of 40 pixel give margin 5 margin left 15 pixel So password href tag which is a forgotten password give it a color of oh my god get, get this color put it here Refresh it. Now you can see thing is not good is the login button. So come come to the login button and first I will give login button margin. Sorry padding. I'll give it a padding of sorry give it margin. 20 pixel and copy the color there is no need to give ok copy this here login button input type equal to submit input type equals submit here we will get background color of background sorry what is the color give it a color here and there is also a border one pixel border so give it border solid and and there is a border radius 2 here is a border radius of 2 pixel so give it border radius 2 pixel and color white let's see ok but height is very small so I will give it a height of 20 pixel which I have given to height will be 20 pixel and I will measure the width width is around 50 pixel so give width of 50 pixel margin seven pixel eighteen pixel margin left give it margin to here margin left twenty pixel
there is no underline underline here in the forgotten account so i will remove the underline from here here text text decoration none it will remove underline from forgotten account so now i have copied the header section to copy the below section i will start the new div then i will work on it so let's start again now go to the html file here the heading tag header tag is closed here so from here i will start uh, body tag i will name it uh, section which will i which i will call body section or create account section and i will divide it in two part one part will be one part one part will be this and the second part will be this section so let's create a div div class equals facebook content name it content block content block content block content block i will divide it in two parts first will be this part and second will be this part so i will name i'm going to name the first part is the connect so i will make two div div class equals facebook connect i will name it facebook connect and close this div comment out facebook connect and the second part is going to be create a, create an account div so i will create another div let me sorry div class equals create account and close this div we have a text so i will write the p button p tag sorry not a button p tag p element tag p p s t element tag here i will write the text facebook helps you connect and share with the people in you your life okay and below this we have image so i will give an image source equals and and i have copied the images already in the images file actually i have copied it here i will put it here world.png which i have named world.png i will call image and world.png now you will see that here we have facebook helps you connect and share with the people in your life and the reason because it is aligning like this is because the plot is not cleared here so i will write a clear fix class here clear fix clear fl both plot so i will write both now i can use now i will use this clear fix div here now the plot is clear and the text is here so i will give a content block margin and 
width which we have given to the header block then will then it will align properly so in the content block i will i will use this property now you will see it has it is aligned just after this now to get this uh, color uh, i will use gradient property of html5 gradient color of html5 so linear gradient i will use the li linear gradient property here before this let me let me grab this color which i will give to the p tag which is inside content block 